Good morning. I stayed at Lost Mountain Shelter last night. Um, it was a really nice shelter and plenty of camping. Like, shit, you could probably fit 40, 50 tents around that area. There's a bunch. Um, had a privy, which I think is one of the first shelters I've seen in a long time that actually had a privy. Um, but uh, yeah. Um, yeah, temperatures were good. It was cool. Weather was nice. It was, it was, it was a great, great sleep. And I think I was, I was out by like eight o'clock. I think I, I slept from like eight to six o'clock. Pretty, pretty good. Just tossed and turned a couple times, but that was about it. But, um, yeah, today's plans are, we are very close to Mount Rogers. I think, uh, I think I'm going to dip down to maybe a road or a parking lot and then we're going to start climbing up to uh mount rogers i think there's one climb before uh mount rogers and if you guys don't know mount rogers is the uh it's the state high point in uh virginia um and i don't think the the summit of mount rogers is part of the at i think it's a blue blaze and i also think it's like a half mile but uh i would like to do that and i think i think hitting that high point would be cool so but um yeah, that's not for, I think, another 10, 11 miles or so. But um, um, today's plans are I would like to get to, uh, well, there's either a 20-mile day that's at a campsite or there's a 23-mile um, a day to um, a shelter. I think it's called Old Orchard. But um, I think I can hit that. I don't know. It depends on how hard the uh, Mount Rogers and the Grayson Highlands are. But, um, um, yeah, that's the plan for today. Um, we'll see the Grayson Highlands today, which will be cool. Mount Rogers, Grayson Highlands, and, uh, um, there's another thing. That'll be the surprise for this video, but, uh, it's right after Mount Rogers. But, um, all right, let's get to it. What's up guys well i just uh came down from uh that was buzzard rock where i was getting that 360 view um that was really cool and it was really windy there um and kind of the it was kind of a little wind chill i mean it's it cold um but i just came down from there um i started eating my oatmeal on the way down um it's kind of it's kind of going down a little bit and then it's going to level out um i think we're walking over to i think it's called white top mountain and then we'll drop down and then start climbing mount rogers so uh yeah that's the update mount rogers is still seven miles away
what's up guys well I just walked into some trail magic uh, they were serving peanut butter and jellies but they didn't have any bread and I think their peanut butter was done too so uh, um, but they did have some bars like granola bars and stuff so I got some of that every little bit helps and I drank a they had some water bottles left but uh yeah that's cool but uh yeah that was a uh, elk I think the elk garden parking lot or something like that but uh it's at the base of I think what I'm getting ready to start climbing is the uh, Mount Rogers so but uh yeah let's get up to Mount Rogers What's up guys well i got to the intersection where you can go do the mount rogers um to go to the summit and that is what i'm doing right now i'm uh climbing up to the summit it's a half mile trail and then a half mile to get back so it's a mile side trip which you know it's quite a bit but uh i think it'd be cool you know while i'm here just to knock out a state high point so uh yeah let's go check it out What's up guys? Well, I'm headed down from Mount Rogers. Yeah, I got up there and there was a, there wasn't a sign or anything. It's just a geological marker, but uh, I had my picture taken. There was a, a few ladies up there. They offered to take my picture. I will overlay it right here, but um, I am now headed back down and I'm gonna join back up with the AT. And then the Thomas Knob shelter is very close by. So uh, I may stop by there, but probably not. Maybe just to get water or something, but I actually think I have a full liter. But um, yeah, we uh, still got a lot to do today. We're gonna go through the Grayson Highlands and then uh, um, see where we end up after that. But um, yeah, that's all I got. I will uh, see you guys in a bit. All right, well, I made it back to the AT. Um, remember this morning when I said there might be something special? waiting for us past Mount Rogers. Well, let's go check it out. What's up guys take a look at that 500 miles man can't believe it <laughs> uh, yeah 500 miles this is what the this was the surprise i was waiting for us but uh yeah um i knew it was right after uh mount rogers and that shelter up there but yeah 500 miles 
Let's go walk 500 more. All right, guys. Well, next thing on the list is the uh, Fat Man Squeeze. There's a cave right there. Let's see if I've lost enough weight. Looks like I lost enough weight. <laughs> man, man, I held that with my, I did that with my trekking poles and carrying the, uh, the camera. Man, shit, that was, <laughs> I slipped and fell on my ass. <laughs> but uh, I'm good though. But uh, all right, let's get to Grayson Highlands. What's up guys? Well, that sign back there said, Grayson Highlands was two miles away. I don't know if I'm in it or not yet, but I know that the state park, so I don't think we're quite there yet. But uh, next on the agenda is Grayson Highlands. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Was he sleeping? <laughs> you sleeping? Hi. What's up guys? Well, I just took a break at the Weiss shelter. Um, just kind of took my shoes off, let my feet air out. My dogs were, they were barking. But um, yeah, that shelter, you can't, uh, you can't ca camp outside the shelter. You have to stay inside the shelter, um, which I wasn't planning on staying there anyway, but just FYI. But um, uh, yeah, the campsite that I'm looking to stay at is in 3.3 miles. So I'm pushing on, it's currently 621. Um, sunset's not till 830, so, and even then there should be still some daylight, but I should get there in plenty of time. But uh, um, yeah, that's the plan right now. I'll see you guys at camp.
What's up, guys? Well, that campsite I told you I was going to stay at, I walked past it. Well, I saw it. But uh, there's no water around there, and even the water that's kind of near it is just kind of puddly. So, um, but I did check far out, and the shelter is only two and a half miles away. But right now it's 8 o'clock, and the sun sets at around 8.30. So I got 30 minutes. Well, I mean, even if it... Usually sets. I don't have a certain amount of time, but uh, I am am going to push to Old Orchard Shelter. So that's going to be a 23 point something day. That'll be my biggest day yet. <laughs> and you can tack on another mile just for going to see Mount Mount Rogers. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll be at camp shortly. I'll see you guys there. What's up guys? Well, I made it to camp. I just want to get on here and say thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the morning. And I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more just to be the man who walks a thousand miles to fall down at your door. Da 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 da